This is a tutorial to show you how to upload files into SoundCloud, audio type files or podcasts. Um, we're using SoundCloud as kind of our audio based YouTube or Vimeo type um, service now uh, for the blogs. So the first piece that you want to do is upload your files into SoundCloud. I'm going to show you how to do that and then we're going to post them in the blog. So I'll show you how to do both pieces of that. Uh, right now we currently just have Orange Parents type podcasts up here. So they're all organized into Parent Link Live. And then they're organized specifically into a set. Um, which shows up on the web page as well as the set. I can show you that. So what's inside this set right here, these eight podcasts are actually what's viewing right here. Um, as well as we can do individual ones here on the sidebar. So let me go into a little more detail on how to upload these into SoundCloud, work with SoundCloud, and then we'll push them up into the blog. All right, so the first thing we're going to want to do is upload a file. I have a test file here. It's just an MP3. SoundCloud will upload just about any kind of audio file. So it's uploading that now. Uh, we'll just call it test audio for now. Um, we don't have um, anything but orange parents. Like I said, the parent links lives up here now. So I'm just going to create a new one because I think this is another area that we're going to use it for. Um, it's called stuff leaders want, and I believe that's some of the things that we're going to be using for um, orange leaders. So once you type it in, then you go down and click that, and it creates that tag. And then you can put a description here of what the audio is about or the podcast to highlight some of that. as well as we could put an image. Um, currently, I have a couple images here. Let me pull up a new window here. Go into profile. So I'm just using this audio type image here. Um, I think I just Googled orange music note and pulled that up. But you can put whatever you want in here. And it'll also show the orange logo as well. So what we have for the main profile of the site, which is right here. All right, so this is almost finished. I want to show you how to organize this. It defaults to all rights reserved, which means that people can't download this by any way, and that it's just, um, you know, it's just available through our website and downloads are disabled by default so um, people can share it and that kind of thing um, the quiet mode this is something that we want to turn off for every upload we don't want any comments because if we do comments then we have to moderate them and we have to have a moderator so that's really the only setting under more options that you're going to want to select is turn off this enable comments for all audio or anything that we push to SoundCloud all right, I'm going to hit save. Now I'm going to go in, let's go to your sound here, now that it's updated. So here's, we've got the sound. And this is how you would add it to that set. So we have this group of eight in here. So if this was a parent link live audio that I wanted to show up on this page, what I would do is I would just, oops, go back to the audio, I would just select this parent link live. And that would automatically add to the set on that page. Um, I don't want to do that, so I'm going to do a new one, which is called Stuff Leaders Want, So and Create, and that creates an entirely new set, and it says we've got one, um, one file or one audio piece in that set, and that's this one. So that's finished now. Uh, to get to more options, you can click that little Edit tab there. And we can tell it a few other things here. Um, let's see. So quiet mode should already be. Oh. Yep. See, disabled comments is checked. That's what we did earlier. So now what I want to do is I'm just going to put podcast. Uh, we've given a genre. 
so it'll organize it in that as well as we tagged it with this so that's pretty much all you need to do there's some other information you could put in here you could put the image like you saw you could put a description but that's pretty much the the basic right there for getting into SoundCloud all right so if I want to share this the way we're going to do this to share it is you have a few options um, we have a link a widget code or we have the sound press or the I'm sorry the WordPress code we will eventually all be using this but because we have different versions of WordPress still uh, on a couple of our blogs I'm just gonna have us default to using the widget code so you just select it and hit copy I'm just right clicking and copying or you can just do a command C in Mac or control C on PC all right, so I've copied that, and now I'm going to go back to the blog on Orange Parents. Actually, I'm going to log in and do it on, let me do it on the development area instead of here. Here we go. So now I'm just on the development. Oop, thought I was. Let me do that again. There we go. I had to load there. Okay, so now I'm in the development area, so it doesn't matter if I post it or not. All right, so it would work the same way as you normally do. You go into a post, and you could add new. And this is, we just call this our test SoundCloud post. Oop. Do that again. Okay, test SoundCloud. And then all I would do is, um, in most cases when you're going to embed these kind of links, what I would do is just click it, make sure it's on text instead of visual. Sometimes it'll say HTML here or, um, um, or text. So I would just leave it on the text and then drop in your code. And I'm going to go ahead and publish this since it's the dev site just so we can look at it. I'm going to view post. And there it is. It dropped that audio right into our blog. So now we have that and it'll play. So that was my test file. So that worked fine. Uh, there's no background there because I'm still creating the dev post um, style sheet and that kind of thing for Orange Parents. But um, that should work fine. All right, so that's basically how to upload a file into SoundCloud, how to categorize it, how to add it to a set, how to edit it, and then how to drop it into a post. So currently we're going to use the iframe or widget code. Um, I may send out an update here in the next month or so just that we're going to start using the SoundCloud code because I think it's a little more secure than using this iframe um, embeds but for right now we're just going to use those because those work across the board and that's it alright hope this was helpful